Good morning, dear students and friends. Let's continue our chapters. That is the NTA UGC Net Set JRF Teaching and Research Aptitude General Paper 1. Let's have a quick review over the syllabus which we have covered. And today, uh, I will show you Unit 7 Data Interpretation. Let's have a quick review of all about the NET UGC GRF and eligibility criteria. Dear students, in every unit I have shown this all. If you haven't seen my previous videos uh, related to the unit, the syllabus, so I will give you the description box, all the related link. Let's start the unit that is data interpretation DI. Dear students, pause the video and find out what I am going to show you and what I have highlighted. Very important topic. Look the every material carefully and after this I will show you some chapter revisions and sample question paper with the answer and hints and solutions. Within a short span we have to cover it. Very minutely I have written it down. So take care. Every point should be clear to you. Now come to the chapter practice. Pause the video and find out the solution, how we can find. Look my handwritten notes carefully and find the solution. And at the end of this chapter revision, I will show you some sample question paper and answers with solution. very important chapter it may help you in other examination also HAS, IAS, IPS, any allied services TGT, PGT etc any other banking services postal services, railway services clerical all related examination entrances this will help you a lot. Pay attention to this particular chapter. And previous year's questions. Pause the video and zoom it out. Try to grasp the thing and the concept clarity.
and here are the answers now check the answers the questions you have attempted now check also how these answer come with explanation hints and solutions previous year's questions solutions if you have done then check it the way you have done that's all for today dear students and friends hope this will help you a lot till then wait for the next video have a nice day all of you